Oh, God, that was a good sleep. That was a really good sleep. Still dark out there. Oh, must have woke up a bit early. You alright, William? How are you doing, mate? God, how long have we been travelling for? It's been about three months, hasn't it? But, after a long, long journey with William, I think, I think we've made it. I think Celsius Village is just over there. Thank goodness for that. It's been a long time. Anyway, William, um, thank you for letting me stay in your tent. I'm going to be uh, heading off now. I need to get to Celsius Village, try and find the next badge. I'm going to throw Pokeballs at you, William. This is how much I love you. What are you saying? West, dude. The tent is telling me to go west. See you around, my man. Yeah, see you later, William. Peace. Oh, God. Yeah, uh... Yeah, go west, William. Maybe I'll see you there. Oh, there's an Ekans and an Arbok going at it over there. Ooh, ooh. Actually, I could do with eating as well. Ooh. Ooh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Apples. That's what it's all about. Alright. So Venom off over there. Ah. It's a bit dark out there. I want to get to Celsius Village. Start thinking about catching and training later on. Because I really need to crack down on... Oh, no. Looks like I don't have a choice. <laughs> okay. Mute. Take it out. Good job. As I was saying, I really need to crack down on the old training. It's been a long time. I want to get. I want to evolve my Charmeleon. I want to see if I can get a Dragonite as well. That'd be really cool. Oh, hold on. Let's have a look. There's a sign here. Celsius Village this way. Yes, this is definitely the place. Great. There's a uh, minecart there as well. Sorry, a uh, track. Let's give it a go. Oh wait, it's a bit broken. Let's try this one. <coughs> we. We. We oh there it is. There's Celsius Village. Was there a sign, John? Oh, flood there! Ha ha! Oh, hoo hoo! Uh, there was a sign there. Let me guess. Caution: lava. Tracks out of order. You're not kidding. You're not kidding. Oh dear. That was a bit scary. It's a Vulpix there. That's pretty cool. Hmm. Do I want a Vulpix? I might want a Vulpix. Come on, computer. Let's get a Vulpix. Let's hit it with a mud shot. Great. Let's have a look. Pokeballs. Great ball. I want a Vulpix. So I think I've got a Firestone, or at least I've got the shards of a Firestone. I can evolve that, that bad boy into Nine Tails. That'd be awesome. I like Nine Tails. That's a really cool Pokemon. Come on, give me a Vulpix. Yeah, there we go. Lovely. Good job, Kabuto. <laughs> right. So, this is Celsius Village. Oh, God. I don't think I like Celsius Village that much already. Ooh, this is a bit risky. Level 31 Electrode coming this way. Coming in hot. Whoa. Careful. Hello, Epodino. Welcome to Celsius... Yeah, thanks. That's what the sign says it, look. Welcome to Celsius Village. The molten, flaming, lethal paradise. Yeah. Um. Okay. God, look at that. Hold on. Watch out. It's a mountain, cliff type thing. Is that a uh, staircase? Oh god, I hope I don't have to go up there at any point. That doesn't look too fun. Let's have a look. Celsius Village Pokemon Care Center. It's always a good place to start. Hello, Penny. Hello, please let me know if you need anything. Okay. Um, uh, Start by healing my Pokemon, I guess. It's always a good start. Oh dear, I think I caught a cold on the road. Got the sniffles today, it's not good. Let's see what we got. What Pokemon have I got? Oh yeah, I need to release some of these at some point, don't I? 
Yeah, I want to start arranging these because I've got an ivy saw here, which I caught. I got that before I even got Mew. There's that Persian. I need to release that at some point. Yoma Star, the Weezing, and the Magma. They all need to be released. Buto, I want to evolve that eventually. Gloom, yep, yep. There you go. I think that's actually all right. Right. Okay. So all I need now is a squirrel, and then I got all three starters. That's pretty cool. There's a trainer over there, mate. Don't come over here. It's horrible. God, where do I start? Where do I start? Hmm. Hello, Noish. Just finished my first ever shift in the mine shaft. So exciting. Fair enough. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, I don't like it here. Zalgan curiosities and supplies. I'll have to look that. Check that out in a minute. What we got over here? A graveler. Oh, and the bridge is broken. Blaine. Ooh. Hello, Blaine. How are you? Hey, kid. You've got the looks of a Pokemon trainer. Yeah. Let me guess. You're here for a badge, right? Yeah. I can help you. Bring me free materials and I'll tell you where to get it. I've got the list written down. It's in that chest there. Good luck, kid. <laughs> How do you laugh like that? But yeah, kind of creepy, Blaine. Kind of creepy. But still, I'm not going to say no to a badge. This is the list, right? I'll have a look at that in a minute. just want to chat to these two. Yeah, I suppose this is... Well, I mean, uh, what was, what was I saying? Yeah, whenever I go to a town and there's a badge in that... I can get a badge near that time. There's always these crystals lying about, so I think I think I'm fo following the right track there. Hello, Armos. The spa is just wonderful after a hard day working the mine. It's a bit hot. It's a bit hot in here, and I got in here without thinking. Now my clothes are all wet. See it. Hello there. You, you looking for a place to stay? The lodge is free of charge, completely volunteer ran, and funded by the mining company here in town. Oh, that'll be cool. That'll be useful. So, um, uh, my good friend William, he's probably gone by now. He doesn't he doesn't mess around, that lad. Hope I see him again. He was uh, very helpful for me after I left Opal City. Had nowhere to go, really. I spent ages sailing, ended up on some weird island. That's where I met him picking mushrooms. Never thought of him as such a uh, nature-conscious man. Picking, them, picking all those mushrooms. I'm sure that's all he was doing. I'm sure he wasn't doing anything strange with those mushrooms at all. <laughs> anyway, what's this book say? What's this book say? Right. Three items are needed for the badge of Celsius Village. Number one. It's hot, but its colour says it's cold. It burns, but it doesn't betray... Oh, what the hell is all this crap? Is this a riddle? Oh, I don't like riddles. Okay, let's... I don't know what that means. Number two. A colour for every town, a colour for every badge. Number three, an enterprise will know. All you need to do is ask for what is mine. A colour for every town, a colour... Well, that one. Mm. That one is... Mm. That one makes me think about the crystals I've been talking about. The crystals I've been seeing around town and stuff. But... It makes sense, because they're all different colour depending on where I am. Like, this is a fireplace. It's not a fireplace, it's a fire elemental sort of town, and there's red crystals here. So, colour for every town. And there's always a badge near a town, or in a town, that has these crystals. So that makes sense to me, that makes sense. There you go. That's one solved already. Okay, number one. It's hot, but its colour says it's cold. It burns, but it doesn't betray the hand that holds it. Don't know what that means. An enterprise. An enterprise is another word for a company, isn't it? Hmm. Company. Well, they said something about mining. Maybe it's a mining company. <laughs> Let's have a look. Whoa, whoa. I don't like this. I don't like this. Red Lake Lodge. Ah, this is the lodge then, is it? Hello, Zane. Hold on. Sorry, that's my book. Welcome to the lodge. Feel free to stay the night free of charge. I will do later. Let's have a look. <laughs> the 
Red Pick Mining Co. That sounds good. Oh, God. All I can hear everywhere is just lava. What's this? Oh, Why would you have that? Why would you have this? Why? It's not even necessary. It's just dangerous. These people here are insane. God. Anyway. S snake. Hello there. Wait, what? Ask for what is my... I didn't even say anything to you. That might, Actually, no, that might mean I'm, I'm on the right track. I bet you Blaine... Blaine set all this up, hasn't he? God damn it. So, it seems like I might be speaking to the right person. Ask for what is mine. Yes, that's the third clue. Ha, huh, I get it. Well, if you want to do some mining, there's a cave outside town with some precious ores near the back. Take a prick... Take a... Sorry? Take a pick and bring me some. You can keep the pick and some of the ore if you want. Alright, cool. I'll get a pick. That'll be useful. Nice. Right, here we are. Entrance of town. Okay. Let's go find this uh, mine then. Ooh. I don't like this lava. It's making me feel nervous again. Hmm. Let's have a look around. Oh, a Pidgey. Not interested in a Pidgey, to be perfectly honest. Don't really want one. I'm hoping that if I can evolve my Charmeleon into a Charizard, I'll be able to fly on it. That'd be cool. That'd help me. That'd really help getting around places. Aha! Here we go. What's this? What do we have here? Red Pick Mining Co. Survey Area 2. Sounds promising. Hmm. Now, what's the ore he was talking about? He said it was at the back of the cave, right? So I'll check out the back first. So I could grab this stuff as well, I suppose, whilst I'm here. Anyway. Better to be safe than to miss out on something important, I guess. Right. Is that some coal up there? I could probably do is make some torches for myself. These are all good survival skills. Hold on. Tin. Ah, oh, this pick's auto smelting. That's pretty cool. That's saved me some time at least. No Pokemon in here though. That's a bit funny. Hmm. Is this it? Looks like it. It looks a bit different, this stuff. Let's have a look. That looks like everything. Right, let's get the heck out of here. What was that stuff? It's Quicksilver. Oh, it's a Pidgeotto. Ooh, what level is he? What level is he? He's level 17. Hmm. Shall I let Charmeleon take him out? Yeah, go on in. Go on, Charmeleon. Here we go. Do him in, Charmeleon. <sighs> Come on. Try another fire blast. There you go. Good lad. Go. Right. Oh, hello, Graveler. <laughs> yeah. Nice and carefully. Nice and carefully. There's a graveler in there. That's a bit funny. I'll tell you what, if it's a wild one, probably is. That's just made its way in. Oh no, he's outside. Uh, that was weird. It looked like he was indoors. Anyway, yeah, Smake, whatever your bloody name is. I've got your ore for you. You said I was allowed to keep the pick, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. And some of the ore. There you go. Right, cheers for that, mate. I'll, I'll see you later. Yeah. Bye bye. Strange guy with a strange name. A lot of the people around here have strange names. I mean, Epodino. We've got Noish. Very odd. Hmm. So anyway, I think that's the first. The first. Sorry, that was the third one. That was, wasn't it? The other one was about the flame thing. By the sounds of it, it sounded like it. They was talking about a flame, like a like a blue flame or something. Because blue. 
blue's like it says that it it's hot but it's cold sort of thing the color says it's cold therefore that means it'll be like a blue or a white or something hmm. so look in the curiosities and supplies hello Zalgan how are you today my friend ah hello good sir I see you're interested in my wares I have a special deal today Anyone who can bring me the gem that sits atop the mountain can choose three items to trade for it. Ooh, that sounds good. Let's have a look. You have a lighter, a boomerang, magic boomerang, don't that. Not really much use to me. A hook shot. That could be useful. That could be quite useful for getting around. And we have Nitor. Ah! Hold on, are they the crystals? Th those are the crystals they have in the town. That must be right then. And then Alimentum. That looks like a blue flame. I think it's those two. I, I actually think it's these two. Right. Right, okay, so crystal atop the mountain. Oh god. Right. Um Not taking any chances, I'm fixing your bridge for you. I don't want to be doing any jumping. I get the feeling I might have to up there. It looks very dangerous. I hope, you, I hope you're satisfied. I hope this is entertaining you, Blaine. It's not entertaining, entertaining me, it's bloody terrifying. Right, let's get up there. Oh, God. Yeah. Oh god, no, I can't go that way, can I? It's bloody. Oh dear. I don't want to get too close to that lava, but... There's not enough room for me to... Alright. Oh, Nearly there. Oh. like it's it. I think that's the crystal. I thought that was a hole then. I thought, oh god, if that drops down there. Nether quartz. Looks a bit funny. I'm not going to lie, the nether quartz looks a bit funny. I was expecting it to be a bit less weird. Maybe, maybe that's what's so special about it. It's invisible. Anyway, let's get back into town. Oh. Back down the bloody mountain. Right, here we go. 